now let's have a look how to access and adjust the Express Keys and the Express Keys setting on your Cintiq Pro 27. I'm again in the Wacom Center and I can use either the schematic image in the center to, to go to the settings or I, I use the tab on the left, select Express Keys. And here, in, now you're in the main center, you will see an overview on all the eight Express Keys for on each side. And you can also choose if you have it for all applications or for a specific application in your workflow. And you will see already some very meaningful settings on each side, like the radio menu, the modifier keys, display toggle, or some others. But to do your own personalized settings, it's very easily done. For example, if I want to change one of the upper Express Keys here, I click on radio menu. And now I get the window where I can find all the recommended actions and where you can also adjust keyboard shortcuts, uh, you can use mouse clicks, you can address radio menus. And for example, in this video, I would simply adjust a keyboard shortcut. Uh, so I click on keyboard shortcut. In this window, um, I can click in the keys area and then the, the driver is waiting for an entry, for a keyboard entry, like Command Z the universal command for undo and I can give it a name here undo and if I now click on apply you will see that one of my express keys is now assigned to the undo command now I've assigned the undo keyboard shortcut to the first express key on my left side of my Cintiq Pro 27 and as you could see here if I now grip to the express key and press that button you would see the undo functionality happen and I will get in a pop-up window saying, okay, on this Express keys, I will have the undo functionality.